the Sukhoi Su-47, a name whispered in awe by aviation enthusiasts. This wasn't just another jet, it dared to be different. Its wings swept forward, defying convention. Imagine a bird of prey, talons outstretched, slicing through the air. That was the Su-47. Forward-swept wings weren't a new idea. Designers had toyed with the concept before. But the Su-47 took it to a new level. It embodied the spirit of innovation, the relentless pursuit of pushing boundaries. This is the story of that pursuit. A story of ambition, ingenuity, and ultimately, unfulfilled potential. But even in its lack of full realization, the Su-47 left an indelible mark on aviation history. The story begins in the 1980s. The Cold War raged on, a period marked by intense rivalry and the looming threat of nuclear conflict. The Soviet Union sought to surpass the West in every domain, including the skies. Their ambition was to dominate airspace with superior technology and unmatched firepower. Their Navy had a problem, American aircraft carriers. These massive ships were not just symbols of power but also formidable platforms for launching air attacks. These floating fortresses posed a significant threat. They could project power far from American shores, challenging Soviet influence on the high seas. The Soviets needed a counter. They required a new kind of aircraft that could neutralize this threat and restore the balance of power. Their answer? A new breed of fighter jet. One that could take off from aircraft carriers, engage in dogfights, and return safely. One that could outperform anything the Americans had. It needed to be fast, agile, and capable of carrying advanced weaponry. This was the genesis of the Su-27KM project, later known as the Su-47, a project that promised to revolutionize aerial combat. It was to be a technological marvel, armed to the teeth and boasting incredible maneuverability. The Su-47 was designed to be a game-changer. The Soviets envisioned a carrier-based aircraft, one that could operate from the limited space of a carrier deck and still perform complex missions. It would need to take off from the limited space of a carrier deck. This required innovative design and engineering solutions, and it needed to be stealthy, able to evade enemy radar. The stakes were high. Success meant dominance. Failure was not an option. The future of Soviet air power hung in the balance. The Su-47 was more than just a plane, it was a symbol of Soviet ingenuity and ambition. But fate, as it often does, had other plans. In 1991 the Soviet Union crumbled. Years of economic stagnation and political turmoil had taken their toll. The once mighty superpower dissolved into a collection of independent states. The collapse had a devastating impact on the Russian military-industrial complex. Funding for ambitious projects like the Su-47 dried up. Many promising programs were scrapped altogether. The dream of a Soviet superplane seemed to vanish overnight. But amidst the chaos, a flicker of hope remained. The engineers at the Sukhoi Design Bureau refused to let their creation die. They had poured their hearts and souls into the Su-47. They knew its potential. Section 4. The Allure of Forward-Swept Wings The concept of forward-swept wings was not new in aviation history. It dated back to the darkest days of World War II. The Germans, desperate for an advantage, experimented with the innovative design. Their creation, the Junkers Ju-287, showed promise but ultimately went nowhere. So why revisit this unconventional wing layout? Forward-swept wings offered tantalizing benefits for pilots, increased maneuverability at low speeds, enhanced stall resistance, and the potential for a smaller radar signature. However, there was a significant catch. Forward-swept wings, especially at high speeds, had a nasty tendency to twist and bend. This phenomenon, known as aeroelastic flutter, could lead to catastrophic structural failure. Section 5 Material Science to the Rescue For decades, aeroelastic flutter remained the Achilles' heel of forward-swept wings. But in the 1970s, a breakthrough occurred. Advances in material science, particularly in the field of composite materials, offered a solution. These new materials, lighter and stronger than traditional aluminum, allowed engineers to build wings with significantly greater rigidity. This paved the way for the Grumman X-29, an American experimental aircraft that successfully demonstrated the potential of forward-swept wings. The X-29 success inspired aircraft designers around the world, including those at Sukhoi. They saw in composite materials a way to overcome the challenges that had plagued earlier attempts at forward-swept wing designs. Section 6. Birth of the Berkut 
The collapse of the Soviet Union left a void in Russian military aviation. The once mighty Soviet Air Force was now in disarray, with many aircraft grounded and airfields abandoned. This period of uncertainty and instability posed a significant challenge for the Russian military. To fill this gap, the Russian Air Force launched two ambitious programs, the Multifunctional Frontline Fighter, or MFI, and the Light Frontline Fighter, or LFI. These programs aim to develop advanced aircraft that could restore Russia's air superiority and modernize its aging fleet. Sukhoi, a prominent Russian aircraft manufacturer, saw an opportunity in these programs. They believed they could leverage their expertise and innovative designs to create a new generation of fighter jets. They believed their forward-swept wing design, now bolstered by advanced composite materials, could meet the demanding requirements of these new programs. This design promised enhanced maneuverability and performance, setting it apart from traditional aircraft designs. However, with government funding scarce, Sukhoi made a bold decision. They would self-fund the development of their radical new fighter, designated the S-37. This move was risky but demonstrated their commitment to innovation and excellence. The S-37, later renamed the Su-47 Berkut, or Golden Eagle, was a marvel of engineering. Its first flight marked a significant milestone in Russian aviation history, showcasing the potential of forward-swept wing technology. Its airframe was constructed extensively from composite materials, giving it exceptional strength and light weight. This innovative use of materials not only improved performance, but also reduced the overall weight of the aircraft. Canards, small wings positioned forward of the main wings, further enhanced its maneuverability. These design elements combined to create an aircraft that was both agile and powerful, capable of performing complex aerial maneuvers with ease. Section 7. Legacy of Innovation Despite its promise, the Su-47 was never adopted for mass production. The reasons were complex, involving a myriad of factors that went beyond just the aircraft's capabilities. The collapse of the Soviet Union had left the Russian economy in shambles. This economic turmoil severely impacted the country's ability to fund large-scale military projects. The cost of developing and producing a completely new fighter jet was simply too high. Budget constraints forced the government to prioritize other areas, leaving innovative projects like the Su-47 on the back burner. Nevertheless, the Su-47 left an indelible mark on aviation history. Its forward-swept wing design and advanced aerodynamics were ahead of their time, influencing future aircraft designs. It made its public debut at the 1999 MAX Air Show, stunning the world with its radical design and breathtaking aerobatic displays. The aircraft's performance captivated audiences and experts alike, though it never entered service, the Su-47 served as a valuable testbed for advanced technologies. These technologies would later be integrated into other aircraft, pushing the boundaries of aviation. Its legacy lives on in the design of modern Russian aircraft, including the stealthy Su-57. The innovations tested on the Su-47 paved the way for the development of these next-generation fighters. The Su-47 stands as a testament to the ingenuity and determination of the Sukhoi Design Bureau. Their relentless pursuit of innovation has left a lasting impact on the field of aviation. Even in the face of immense political and economic upheaval, they dared to dream of a better future. A future with aircraft that defied expectations and pushed the boundaries of what was possible. The Su-47 remains a symbol of that daring vision, inspiring future generations of aerospace engineers and aviation enthusiasts.